Good afternoon, we're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. And thus begins our downtown Chicago adventures for the next whole day. day. A little yes. staycation. Yeah, doing a one night stay at a cool hotel that we're gonna check in later at. Right, but it's first, the first the first time we've ever been hosted somewhere, so yeah. that's exciting. Can't wait to check out the hotel, but first we have to stop at one of Sarah's old classmates, cool studios that I've been Jones in the go see yeah. for years now and she's in town, she's in the studio working, so we're walking over now. Yeah, and she's not it. just a classmate, she is like a friend that I've continued to stay close with. She actually ran the photo booth at our wedding. And did our design our wedding invitations. Yeah, so she's so cool and I'm, I'll put all of her like Instagram stuff below because we'll show some of inside she did a, studio. Didn't she do like a patch for the Hillary Clinton campaign? I think a pin. A like pin. A, yeah, she was selected for that, so she's beyond town. But she does calligraphy and lettering and chain stitching, oh. among other things. The streets and the houses. <laughs> oh, I love We're this city. Happy. So we have like a mile walk, but we are happy about it. Yeah, look at this. Because we love these houses. These houses, the apartment complexes, the three flats, the bungalows. This church has the coolest little display out in front with the trans and the pride flags and the Black Lives Matter. What is it called? Wicker Park Lutheran. Wicker Park Lutheran. Way to be. Love it. Love that. So we got so lucky with the weather today. I don't even need this jacket. Anymore. Right. Well, we also been walking and like I'm sweaty. I don't know if you are or not. A little bit. But um, yeah, it is so nice out. We are in Ukrainian Village. Yeah, and we're about to, I think it's one of these storefronts here. Chicago. No Bones Chicago. How wait, wait, wait. No Bones Beach Club. I don't know why no I had no Chi I had Chicago. Oh, it's right here. Yeah. It's now hiring bartenders and support staff. All right, we're at No Bones. We just ordered $77 worth of food with tip, but it's going to be a lot. We were going to go to like a fancy restaurant. You know what I mean? I got a margarita, and you guys know I don't do that often. Sarah got a fancy mojito. Mojito. I looked over here. I didn't realize there's, there's three of these. There's one in Chicago, Portland, and Seattle. So we're still schlepping our uh, luggage around. Gonna eat Next this stop. and then go check into our hotel. The cool thing about our hotel is that they're like, hashtag is stay like a local. So that's what we're doing. We're just doing everything like we're locals here. Yes. Okay, our food is already here. It's here, Peter. <laughs> There's jars playing in the bathroom. Really? <laughs> okay, this is chowder. So excited. This is like, a mock crab cake sandwich. These are loaded nachos with jackfruit carnitas. And those are called amaze balls and they are deep fried macaroni and cheese. Delicious things with like ranch. I told you this is my favorite plant-based food I've ever had, even more than Market on South. I'm so excited. How do you feel? I feel like Thanksgiving Day full. Which is a good thing because we're about to order an Uber to take it to our hotel. Because that happened. Yeah. Um. Okay, this is our hotel we're staying at tonight. Hotel Versi. Yes. 
And then that's Clark and Broadway. We used to live right off of Broadway. Sarah, when she thought she had an eye, pink eye, but she had an <laughs> eye issue with her contacts. She went to the doctor right there. I did. And this was the first Stan's Donuts we ever went to. Wow. All right, look at this fancy thing. Stay like a local. So this used to be a rock and roll hotel. Yeah. Look at that, artist Joe Miller. Of a good Chicago star. Yeah. Wow. My kind of town, Chicago is. This fancy oh, All different kinds of stickers. Smells like a hotel. Peter's a hotel snob. I am a hotel snob. Um, so that's cool. A hotel is actually a day's in, but it's like a boutique day's in. Okay. They used to have rock and roll people stay here all the time. The person at the front desk even told us that Tyra Banks, Tyra Banks recently stayed here. Fancy pants. So there's a lot of like small venues, like music venues around here, so that makes sense. Yeah, they said the jazz festival that happens here in Chicago, yeah. which lights up the whole city. Um, gets busy around here. It's all cubbies. And the Ferris wheel. Are you the old Ferris wheel? You are the old Ferris wheel. Our view, we can see Urban Outfitters. And Express and Trader Joe's. All right, room is very big. It is big. For a hotel room. And it's like, just like crisp and clean. I'm just like, this is a very large hotel room. Yeah. But got it, what, queen or king? king. This is a king. king. Nice little reading area. It's weird that the fridge and the microwave are in a closet, it's just but quirky. it's quirky Chicago love. And if you don't know anything about that, is a lot of these older buildings are very fixed in how the architecture looks. So a lot of times, like there'd be no good way to divide a room like this or to not utilize the giant closet. But you got our TV here with a little bit of boutique hotel history. Bathrooms, pretty large, pretty good size for. Um, a Chicago hotel. This is really cool. So like we said, it's like stay like a local, but they even have a lot of different things to do in this area on this little thing. But I just want to read this first, um, the first paragraph. So it says, so let's start with the basics. When you walk out of the front door of the hotel, to your left is east, to your right is west. East will take you to the lakefront, west to the L trains. Diversity is a street in front of the hotel. Clark is to your left and Halstead to your right. So just like kind of puts it in like easy terms, like it's super easy to get around Chicago because it is on a grid. Um, so if you know your left from your right, like you're all good, but I'll show this here. So if you want to pause and take a better look, you can, and then there's even more on the back. <laughs> I like that in case of emergency call 911, <laughs> like Chicago going to have a different kind of emergency phone number. Yes. Just cool local tips. Super awesome. Like we kind of said before, um, the first time we're st we're that we're being hosted by somebody. Yeah. So that's cool. It's just quick one night yeah. in a cool boutique hotel. So And right. I, I think because it's a day's in, if you're ever looking for Chicago, I think this place is a, on a nice price scale. I think it's yeah. less than a, a buck fifty a night. Yeah. Um, and, and you are a little location. north. But yeah, a little north, but close to the trains. And I think that... Whenever you stay in Chicago, it is nice to take the train somewhere, just like as a part of the experience. Feel like I know. A local. Yeah, whenever anybody asks us for like Chicago advice, that's one of like my generic tips. Is like, it's less than five bucks to just hop on the train and go somewhere. So. I think we chill, and we get out of here. Okay. I want to see our city. Yeah. On the way out, Sarah spotted her one true love. Mr. Mickey M. Mouse. Look at this. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so we are going to take this train into the loop. Alright, just left the L. 
got off on Diamond Row. Diamond, Diamond Row? Jewelers. Jewelers Row. Jewelers Row. Jewelers Row. Who do you think you are? I, I'm, brush, I'm brushing the rust off my Chicago nose. <laughs> but we are walking up to Michigan Avenue. The tree got lit already. You guys, we realized I don't think we're gonna make it to Chris Kinder Market tonight because it closes at eight. Yeah. But we've got more downtown time. It feels so good to be surrounded by these tall buildings. It really does. <sighs> and the tree's now at Millennium Park, so we're about to see it. Yes. Ready? Ready? Ready for it? Ready for it? Ready for it? And boom! <gasps> there it is. Oh, isn't that the most beautiful city? Chicago Athletic Association. Yeah, look at this. Shepard. Boys. What? Oh my gosh. It's karate Chop Santa. Wow. <laughs> we decided to make it to, to Happy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Welcome to Vlogmas where we vlog every day. It might be boring, but I hope you I stay. You know that. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, whatever you celebrate. Crazy. This is crazy. I was not expecting this. This man. I want to know what this place looks like. Is this incredible? Is it Christmas all the time? No. Alright, here at Happy's, they're going for the Christmas cheesy basement vibe. But look at this awesome photo op. Sarah and Lauren are going to get in there. Glasses or no glasses? Glasses. We had to get a better view. We had to say bye to Lauren and her dad because they're going to get dinner and go to their hotel for the night. But look at that, look at that tree. Guys, Sorry, there's a bus. Our first date was over there. Our first date was over there, you're right. Watching little kids. Oh my god, I like a choir performance. Because even then, 10 years ago, we were obsessed with kids back then. Mm -hmm. And we and still Christmas. are. We're going to Macy's or where Marshall Fields, it used to be Marshall Fields. Um, to see if there's a holiday lane because if you remember last year we get there and it was gone and it was like one of our favorite things ever so we're gonna go check it out yay this feels like home oh I know I was gonna say that like I really just want to scream it's good to be home are you nervous I am I am nervous What's holiday trim? Okay, so that used to be holiday lane. Maybe holiday trim is just a new spot for it. This is literally a, a integral, this is like a core memory if you're if you're a fan of that movie. Yeah. And it's not right. Okay, okay. There's some some heartfelt things here. That's a cool door. So we found the Linux section in the corner. It's not just Linux, it's all it's all of like the finer stuff. So the finer ch holiday china. Mm -hmm. And on the corner I see some ornaments. I think it's like, it's just spread out. It's okay. like over this whole floor because then the tree is right there. I peeked. You peeked? Did peek. you see the tree? Yeah, the bottom of it. So there is like, there's all the Christmas stuff. All right, let's explore because there's only 15 the minutes. It's just not the same. Yeah. Stop. We must explore. Sarah found our jam, Spode. This is what we do. But we've been eyeing, the, we've been eyeing either one of these. Fitz and Floyd. Um, cars with Santa. We've been eyeing that one and this car because it kind of reminds us of our Room 66 honeymoonness for a couple of years now because that keeps coming back. So we've been eyeing that. I want like a, a Santa's cookies and milk set. Oh, like a little plate display to put out for a good old St. Nick. Okay, so we snuck in to see the tree close up because it looks like the like where you could observe. You can't go up there anymore. I like I like the red. Yeah. One time we played hooky from school and we came here for lunch. Because we were that classy college people that so we would skip class and go to the walnut room for Chicago famous chicken pot pie. Mm-hmm. And frango. And frango mints. Oh frango, oh, frango pie. Frango pie yeah. for dessert. Yeah. Okay, here's the famous Macy's holiday windows and we accidentally watched them in first in reverse order. Yeah. So here is the first window. <laughs> Santa's sleigh has some trouble, so this snow pal saves the day. I love an original story. Yes. Now we're down here on the river. Literally, you can just walk right into the river if you wanted to. Some famous Chicago architecture and city winery. Oh, you're just gonna take a little relaxing break? These are nice. They are. Nice to come at, like over here on my lunch and read. 
Can you tell that Peter's super excited about everything? Are you making fun of me? No, I'm just saying like, I can always tell in the vlog when you are like, you just want to show everything that like, your heart is happy. Like, huh? this? Yeah. like this? Yeah. Like this? Like this? Like this? Like this? Like, like. Like this spooky water? We looked at this Starbucks reserve online and it said that it was closed. There's legitimately a line. And there's legitimately a fireplace. Get in. There's a fire inside it on the th third floor. There's so many people up there. All right, we are coming to the end of the Magnificent Mile, the one mile strip of stores in downtown Chicago that we adore, that we spent. It was our bread and butter for our date nights yeah. in high school. Our spitting lunch. Our spitting lunch, which we didn't see today. Yeah, we actually did. But look at across the street, Lee Adams, I need to know what is going on with this because it is perplexing. The Toys R Us adventure? So we're going to the Signature Lounge, which is in the John Hancock building, 97th floor, I think? 96th, because the restaurant's 95. Cool. And so yeah, it's just a one drink minimum. It's like something that we always tell people to do because it's not like an observatory, just to, to change, like chill at the lounge and stuff. And it's good weather tonight. All right. We're coming up to the John Hancock Pavilion. Got the Cheesecake Factory and everything. But look at here, another gorgeous tree. One solid big old tree. And up, up, up we're gonna go. Does it feel like you're 21 years old? It feels good. In the fanciest bar in town? Yeah. So I got a Coke. I got get... a golden wheat ale made, I think, just for this bar. Yes. It's called a View from the Top. For downtown vibes, that's a good amount of guac. Yeah. We won't tell you how much this costs. $16. Okay, I guess we are. ANC Navy Pier, All right there too. All right, here we're waiting for the 22 bus, Delaware and Dearborn, right by Washington Square Park, which is, if you remember, last Christmas when we stayed at that Airbnb, this is the park that I brought Eve on a walk around. Okay, we're back at the Versi. All right, we're back at our hotel room. We are exhausted. We are I full. I even dozed on the bus. I was like, did we miss our stop? <laughs> I am so happy that we're here. And this, like, truly, our date night wouldn't have happened without Hotel Versi. So, yeah. thank you again. If you're in the area, mm -hmm. a little bit further north of the hardcore downtown area, but mm -hmm. literally a perfect spot because it's a little bit more calm. Great restaurants, all the mm -hmm. good stuff. Just check it out. Yeah. Check it out. It is good to be it's good to be Sweet home. home Chicago. Oh. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>